there's apparently some in my box spring of my mattress in my bedroom, sir. We've been uh, bringing you in-depth coverage tonight on Maxime Bernier's dramatic resignation. Now more about that bug his ex-girlfriend says was planted in her bed. As we heard, the Prime Minister doesn't buy it, but it certainly is intriguing. What we wanted to know is how plausible is Julie Cuillard's claim, and how would it be carried out? The CBC's Lynn Robson asked some personal security experts for their perspective. If you think your boss, your buddy, or your enemy has bugged your house, Stefan Nadeau's the man to call. Hi, Hi. Stefan. What have we got in here? The CPM 700 from Research Electronics. It's the basic sweep kit in order to process a sweep. He is a professional bug hunter. His clients include corporations and anyone who has that feeling, like Julie Quial's sinking feeling, that something was not right. My sixth sense, I knew I could feel it that I was watched, I was listened to. Of particular interest to Nadeau and others in the security business, Quial's claimed that someone bugged her bed. There was apparently some in my box spring of my mattress in my bedroom. Nadeau's reaction, exactly the same as every other professional I spoke to today. It would not be the place a professional eavesdropper, I believe, would we'll place a bug. Nadeau agrees to show us how to play hide and seek with bed bugs. I would go underneath the box spring and spread and slice just the fabric, the, the fabric and put, put the, the microphone in a place where you can listen to the audio if I were to do so. But he wouldn't do so. Too much fabric in a bed for good audio. A professional would rather bug the light switch or the phone where an electrical charge powers the bug. Then there's Quial's claim the buggers were fastidious. Even the, 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 the material under my bed, it was like nicely cleaned up. The Her whole story is hard to believe, says Nadeau. I cannot say it's impossible, but I'm skeptical. But if there were a bug in this room, a professional sweeper would seek out radio frequencies to locate it. And voila, one more bed bug bites the dust. Lynn Robson, CBC News, Montreal.